guys, it's up, it's Mr. here. Today we are back on the Stanley Parable. And last uh, we left off, we did an adventure All line thing. All were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Maybe I've missed a memo. Okay, last time uh, I played, I remember seeing a input somewhere. Not entirely sure where the inputs are, though. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Okay, now this time we're going to go to the right, and we're going to see what is This was in not the... the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. In Perhaps the he wanted to stop by the room. employee lounge first, just to admire it. Okay. Yes, truly Here we are. a room worth admiring. It had really been, been like worth the times. detour after all. I just, just to spend a few moments a here in this immaculate, beautifully constructed room. Stanley simply stood here, drinking it all in. Yep. But okay. eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. We've already done that, so let's go this way and see what is... Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. Do not lie. If you are lying right now, stop. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to check out what is in the red room this time. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gone off on the wrong Oh, road. shoot! But in his eagerness to prove that he is in control of the story and no one gets to tell him what to do, Stanley leapt from the platform and plunged to his death. I didn't Good think news. about that. <laughs> Everyone thinks you are very powerful. Ah, input right there. Boop. Okay, that input is done. Stanley walked through the red door. Red door it is. Oh, thank God you are willing to listen to me. Do you see that I really have wanted you to be happy all this time? The sure. problem is all these choices. The two of us always trying to get somewhere that isn't here. Running and running and running, just the way you're doing right now. Don't you see that it's killing us, Stanley? I just... I wanted to stop. Okay. I would... Okay. We would both be so much happier if we just stopped. And I think... Well, I think I have a solution. Here. Ooh. Okay. Let me show you. What, either door I can go through? Okay. What is the solution? Hmm. What do we want? What are we looking for? Hmm? Here. Yes. Oh, it's beautiful, isn't oh, it? Oh, wow. If we just stay right here, right in this moment with this place, Stanley, I think I feel happy. I actually feel happy. <laughs> it's good. I think this is copyrighted music. <laughs> okay, I'm I'm almost a hundred percent sure this is copyrighted music. <laughs> I'm gonna get out of this room. No, wait. Where are you going? This why? Right. Where were we? Uh, nine minutes away. Oh no! Stay away from those stairs! If you hurt yourself, if you die, the game will reset! We'll lose all of this! Alright. Gonna kill myself! Murder! Suicide! Please, no, Stanley, let me stay here. Don't take this from me. Now I don't want to. Ah! Woo! No. Ow. Oh, thank God you lived. You had me worried there for a moment. Now, can we please get back to the other room? Okay. There. See? This is what you want. This is where we can both be happy. We really yeah. can. If we stop moving, we just have to stop moving. Nah, I'm gonna go Stanley, kill myself again. Go back. There's nothing good that can come from this. Go kill myself. 
I don't know, I survived the first time, but we'll do it this time. Oh no, what do you, do you just not believe me? What can I say to convince you? Jump off an edge. That's all that's going through my head right now. But oh. Whee! Ow. Stanley, let's go back to the other room. My god, is this really how much you dislike my game? Did you I throw yourself that. from this that... platform over and over to be rid of it? It's You're ended. Truly willing to kill yourself to keep me from being happy? Am I reading the situation correctly? Well, now, now I'm the villain. <laughs> Dang it! Ah, woo! Ow. Well, maybe you're just getting a kick out of it. Yeah, kind of. I don't of. know anymore. I just wanted us to get along. I do I too. Guess that was too much to ask. Sorry, it dude. Looks like you wanted to make a choice after all. Well, this one is yours. Man, that's a really sad ending right there. It really is. Is it over? It's going to restart, isn't it? I'm going back. Alright, so this time we're going to find that uh, other input, if we have another input here. Wait, what? The phone's ringing. Message scheduled either by you or person in your place of work. The purpose of this message is to warn you about the dangers of recorded messages. If at any time you believe you are listening to a recorded message, please terminate it immediately and cease all flow of information from the recorded message into your perceptual sphere. Thank you and have a pleasant day. What? Okay. I don't think I've ever heard that one before. Ah, input. There's two inputs. Okay, here we are right back in this room. I, I don't know. I don't have any idea what happened there. When Stanley All came right. to a set of two open We're looking for another computer. He entered the door on his left. And I believe there's a clerk's computer up here. Let's see if I can't find more inputs. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief. With no expectation Stanley of promotion or recognition. That's what I was looking office, at before. Hoping he might find an answer there. Okay. Oh no. Oh no 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 no. Not again. I won't be part of this. I'm not going to encourage you. I'm not going to say anything at all. I'm just going to be patient and wait for you to finish whatever it is you enjoy doing so much in this room. Please take your time. <laughs> Dang it! I thought you'd do the broom closet one again. I like the broom closet one. That's like my favorite one. Okay, upstairs, I believe Coming there is a, a computer. Staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Okay, there is a computer right here. Nothing. Okay. That door is locked. That door is still locked. Okay, so... I don't think the boss has anything else in here. But I'm going to finish it the right way. Stepping the, into the his wrong manager's way, office, I guess. Stanley was once again stunned to discover what not an it? indication of Two, any human life. Two, eight, four, Shot, five. Unraveled. Stanley was in such a rush to get through the story as quickly as possible, he didn't even have a single minute to just let the narrator talk. Well, come that on! kind of anxiety isn't healthy, so he relaxed for a few moments with some calming New Age music. Okay. <laughs> Feeling soothed? And rejuvenated, Stanley calmly walked forward into the opened passageway. Calmly walk forward, sure. <laughs> All right, I didn't know if you if you rushed me to do that. All right, Oop, button time. All right, loading into our new area: mind control or escape. I'm gonna go to the mind control this time, though. See what's down that route. Mind control idle awaiting input. Doo -doo 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 -doo. And when at last he found the source 
Oh, Stanley, you didn't just activate the controls, did you? Yeah, I did. After they kept you enslaved all these years, you go mm -hmm. and you try to take control of the machine for yourself. Is that what you wanted? Control? Kind of, yeah. Oh, Stanley, I applaud your effort, I really do. But you need to understand, there's only so much that machine can do. You were supposed to let it go, turn the controls off, and leave. If you want to throw my story off track, you're going to have to do much better than that. I'm afraid you don't have nearly the power you think you do. For example, and I believe you'll find this pertinent, Stanley suddenly realized he had just initiated the network's emergency detonation system. In the event that this what? machine is activated without proper DNA identification, nuclear detonators are set to explode, eliminating the entire complex. How long until detonation then? Mm, let's say um, two minutes. Ah, now this is making things a little more huh. fun, isn't it, Stanley? It's your time to shine. You are the star. Oh. It's your story now. Shape it to your heart's desires. Oh, this is much better than what I had in mind. What a shame we have so little time left to enjoy Incorrect. it. Mere moments until the bomb goes off. But what precious moments each one of them is. More time to talk about you. What? About is this actually a code? Where are we going? What all this means? I barely know where to start. What's that? You'd like to know where your co-workers are? Area will not silence access. Before you're obliterated. All right, I'm in a good mood. You're gonna die anyway. I'll tell you exactly what happened to them. I erased them. I turned off the machine. I set you free. Of course, that was merely in this instance of the story. Sometimes when I tell it, I simply let you sit there in your office forever, pushing buttons endlessly and then dying alone. Other times, I let the office what? sink into the ground, swallowing everyone inside, or I let it burn to a crisp. I have to say this, though. This version of events has been rather amusing. Watching you try to make sense of everything and take back the control wrested away from you, it's quite rich. I almost hate to see it go. But I'm sure whatever I come up with on the next go-around will be even better. My goodness, only 34 seconds left. But I'm enjoying this so much. Mm. You know what? To hell with it. I'm going to put some extra time on the clock. Why not? Well, thank you. These are precious additional Zero, five, two, one. Wait, five, two, one. Oh, it's one. Oh, it's... These are all different oh, numbers. Me, what's the matter, Stanley? Is it that you have no idea where you're going or what you're supposed to be doing right now? One, two, four. Or did you just assume when you saw that one, timer four, two. that something in this room was capable of turning it off? I mean, look at you. Running from button to button, screen to screen, clicking on every little thing in this room. Ooh, one. Hit the one button. One no, button's over here. These colored ones. Or maybe this big red button. Oh, oh you jerk. Sure. Everything, anything, something here will save me. Why would you think that, Stanley? That this video game can be beaten? One solved? Do you have any idea what your purpose in this place is? <laughs> Stanley. You're in for quite a disappointment. But here's a spoiler for you. That timer isn't a catalyst to keep the action moving along. It's just seconds ticking away to your death. You're only still playing instead of watching a cutscene. Push the one button. Watch you for every moment that you're powerless to see you made humble. This is not a challenge. It's a tragedy. You wanted to control this world. That's fine. five. Two, but I'm going five. to destroy it first, so you can't. Take a look at the clock, Stanley. Two. That's 30 seconds you have left to strike. Wine. 30, 30 seconds, seconds Jeez. until a big boom and then nothing. No ending here. Just you being blown to pieces. Will you cling desperately to your frail life? Or will you let it go peacefully? Another choice. Make it count. Oh, hmm. dude, it's all the same to me. All a part of the joke. And believe me, I will be laughing at every second of your inevitable life from the moment we fade in until the moment I say happily ever up. And we blew up. I don't know if you can actually win that one. It doesn't look winnable. There's no clear uh, victory uh, shown, I guess. There's like no co- Ooh, why is there stuff in the ground? Stanley had never seen the office this brightly lit. Was it a sign of something? He hoped it was. He hoped very much that it was. Okay. I don't remember... I can't get back in my room. 
I'm trying to find the um the inputs again. Any more inputs in here? Or any other way that <laughs> Dad decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Okay, this time we're gonna go to the Coming escape to direction case, because Stanley that sounds cool. Walked upstairs to his boss's office. All right, can I hit a button? <gasps> Ooh, input received! Yay! I have what? Two more left. It looks like. Ooh, okay. Is there anything in here I need? This no. Okay, so I don't think there's uh, I don't think there's a computer in the bathroom, but I see all but two two of them I think. All right, we're gonna go check out the other input. The other direction, the exit area. Okay, I think we all know the drill by now. Blah, blah, blah. Dark secrets, the keypad. Stanley pushes some buttons. Oh, hey, look, it's a new passageway. Yay! Surprise. I like how you remember sometimes what you do. Alright, hoorah! Wow, that went really quick. We didn't even have a loading screen thing. Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Says Facility. escape this way. This is the way I'm going. this passageway had the word escape written on it, the truth was that at the end of this hall, Stanley would meet his violent death. I hope not. The Says door escape. behind him was not shut. Stanley still had every opportunity to turn around and get back on track. Nah. I would go At this uh, point, Stanley was myself, making a conscious, concerted effort to walk forward and willingly confront his death. Yep. Well, must be death down there. Whee! Oh, it's a loading screen. Okay, what's down here? Huh. Um, I can't really move. I'm pressing fall, fell so far. And Stanley was inched closer and closer to his demise. It reflected that his okay. life had been of no consequence. Ooh, there's a location down there, though. Stanley can't see the picture. He doesn't know the real story. Trapped forever in his narrow vision of what this world is. Uh -oh. Perhaps his death was of no great loss. Like plugging the eyeballs from a blind man. And so he resigned and willingly accepted this violent end to his brief and shallow life. There was Stanley. Wait, 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 wait. We can get, get out of this. Farewell, Stanley, cried the narrator as Stanley was led helplessly into the enormous metal jaws. In a single visceral instant, Stanley was obliterated as the machine crushed every bone in his body, killing you? him instantly. All right! Stanley Parable! This way. And yet All right. it would be just cool. a few minutes before Stanley would restart the game back in his office as okay. alive as ever. What exactly did the narrator think he was going to accomplish? When every path you can walk has been created for you long in advance, death becomes meaningless, making life the same. What? Do you see now? Do you see that Stanley was already dead from the moment he hit start? What? That's my office. This is the... What? This is the corridor. Uh, I guess it starts with the two decisions. This is like the behind the scenes of the game. That's awesome. Three different colored. I've only seen, I think, one color though. Huh, they all have different noises. Cool. And the inputs? No input, no input, no input. Huh. Cool. Alright, what else we got around here? Oh, here's the credits for you. Original music by, uh, I don't know how to say her, her name. Or his name. Yianis? Ioannis. I, 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 yeah. Blake Robinson, Christian. Backer. Leslie. Maybe if you guys want to read this, just look at him. 
and pause it and see it. Oh, Kevin Brighton is the narrator. Cool. He's got a really great voice. All right, the office. Maintenance room. Early version of the maintenance room. Cool. Cool. Uh, whoa. Point of Stanley Parable HD mi Remix is to lose. More endings, fewer endings, more narrations, fewer narrations, more Stanley, less Stanley. Oh. Am I going crazy? Maybe it isn't the same image. Huh. I'm going to have to check and make sure that clock's there. Ooh, what's this one? Warzone. Early development. We designed an ending where Stanley would end up on a battlefield fighting aliens. <laughs> the action game would become scented, sentient and would wage war against the narrator. Ooh, the cargo list was intended to offer a choice of staying on or jumping to a different path. However, in this early version, we decided we wanted the option for the player to fall to his death. Huh. Interesting. All right, so this is giving me ideas on what else I could do here. I'll probably look through this more uh, in the future. Zending levers. Zending model. Hmm. All right. Stan Lee Parable. <laughs> oh, look at these two. How they wish to destroy one another. How they wish to control one another. How they both wish to be free. So I can just turn it off right here? Can you see? Can you see how much they need one another? No, hmm. perhaps not. Sometimes these things cannot be seen. But listen to me. You can still save these two. You can stop the program before they Wait, both what? fail. Push escape and press quit. There's no other way to beat this game. As long as you move forward, you'll be walking someone else's path. Stop now and it'll be your only true choice. Whatever you do, choose it. Don't let time choose for you. Don't let time Oh! Okay, so that's how you get back into the game. Cool. I need to get another, uh... Computer, there it is. Computer input. Uh, there's yes, there two was left. Not a single person here either. Although Feeling I think they're all in the other room. Disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his I don't know if I'll be able office. to get it from here. Okay, there's <laughs> Here's the door, just go. <laughs> Alright, um, I've already done all those endings, so I'm going to go back and I'm going to see if I can find the start again. Oh, phone's ringing again. Hi, Stanley. I uh, just wanted to leave you a message to let you know there's a few things I need you to pick up on your way home from work today. Okay. We need milk, cereal, dish soap, spaghetti, get a thing of sugar, some bread, and coffee beans, whichever ones you like. I'll give you a call if there's anything I forgot. Thanks, sweetie. See you tonight. And my, my wife sounds great. There's the input. Input received. Okay. Did I check my computer this time? Ah, right, there's nothing on my computer. That's kind of cool. Okay. I'm going to check all these computers real quick, make sure there's none left, and then I'm going to... I think I'll be done after that. Because there's nothing there, so I got to... Restart again. I've noticed it. Oh, okay. So sometimes when you go in, the computers, uh, they some of them are on, Stanley some of them are had never seen the office this brightly lit. Was it a sign of something? He hoped it was. He hoped very much that it was. I need to get back inside. Just a second. I just want to make sure there's nothing going on here. But Stanley simply couldn't handle the pressure. Dang it. What if he had to make a decision? What do I do? Heaven! Portons! Portons! Oh my 
my goodness! This is great! I like this ending! This is an awesome ending! Alright, so that's what the input one does. Alright, well, I will be back in another episode eventually. Um, as a Stanley Parable. i take a little break again. And, uh, yeah, this was kind of cool. We also found that the, uh, if you keep trying to get to the, to the, uh, broom closet, that it keeps locking up. So that's kind of cool. Anyways, make sure to leave a double thumbs up down below if you like to see, and we'll see you in the next one. Um, I'll try to get all the rest of the endings. Um, I gotta check what I have and then see what I haven't done yet. Because I can't remember if I actually stayed on that righty shelf thing. Uh, the thing that... He, like, wants you to go somewhere. Instead of jumping off or killing yourself jumping off, um, I can't remember if I actually did that yet. So I'm going to check my footage real quick and uh, see if I've done that, and then I'm going to try to do some more stuff. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>